an audio recording of Nairobi Governor Mike Mbuvi Sonko and the newly elected member of parliament for Embakasi South Honorable Julius Mawade has emerged online. And in that audio, the governor, Governor Sonko, is heard lecturing the newly elected member of parliament. I've actually, in, in, a, in just a, a, a few seconds, you are going to listen to the whole audio. But two things are clear from the audio. I've listened to it. Two things are clear. Number one, Mike Sonko, from the, from the look of things, actually set up the whole scheme. Either Mawade called him and he recorded the Mawade or he called Mawade with the recording him in his mind to set up Mawade against the people whose land are going to be affected. Number two, Mike Mbubi Sonko probably wanted a way of being seen as defending the rights of the local residents whose lands are going to be affected. I don't know the other thing he wanted to achieve by that audio recording, but if you listen to it keenly, you realize Mike Sonko is actually setting up Mawade. So his game plan is still not known, but this is not new controversy involving Mike Sonko and phone recording. So listening to the conversation between the two leaders. Governor, you're on speakerphone. Oh, Moshimiwa Mawade. Sir, yes, sir. I'm in, high, I'm, I'm, I'm in court with Harrison Kinyanju, yeah? Yes. Your order in 1996, 96, and the applicant of that order is dead already, so the son cannot execute it. And please do not... The county has not been involved. I've just sent my legal advisor today. We shall resist that demolition. Whether the, the DC is there, I don't want to know. We should not displace people. That is crime against humanity. Let us consult widely. Ah, what we come and pass our meongo our regeshe. We come and barabara in a pizza. Let's Kura come, Kera come. I come county to 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 inspect to get to now. Bomolea wapi. I shall never allow people who have been residing there for the last fifty years. Wabomolea kama maumbwa. That one, forget it. Forget it. It will never happen under my administration. Never, never, ever try to evict. A single Nairobian without consulting the national government and the county government. Musiari be a rice siasa. I was in River Road yesterday. I was told, do not talk about the president here or Aila. We are suffering. We are dying. We are crying. We are being auctioned. This is from the people of Mount Kenya who reside in Nairobi. How what to Wasiari be a rice siasa? Never allow any sort of demolition to happen. I'll be the first person to die when those bulldozers come there. No negotiation, no demolition, no eviction. Full stop. And I'm looking for the president. What wacha ushanzi? Ah, what walipigia jubilee kura? Walipigia rais kura? Walipigia sanko kura? Wawacha ushanzi ya kupiga wananchi? Ha, wasimami tena? Wasipiga raya? Nimekata? Uyo muindi ya kwande? Na nikuja hapo nita mpiga makofi? Shanzi yeye? Stupid! Ataona, ajari muko pisa mtu mbondi ataona Akuja tuko na pesa kauntu tumlipe Akwande huko Asilata uchinga Ukipia mwana nchi mmoja You cannot displace 100,000 people With your money, stupid What's that jari mkuja ataona You mobilize people Mwashimu wa mobilize watu Wacha tukufe na raia Mobilize watu Mobilize na mimi na mobilize Tukufe yako Watu na kia watu Mama wabekuna pesa mwini Walegase Uh, 
I, my friend, I'm the co-chair of Nairobi Regeneration. I stopped all the demolitions in Nairobi. And I'm going to see the president today. What are you going to do for tension? Munawa, what you kill a sick na tension? What are you going to do? Now we are going to teach you to do for the To the community, to the government, to the Kwanza. The first people to die with our people. I'm going to start in Kine. Unakwanza wa mwenda choki hapo, akwande. Mwenda fukwa lifati sabwa chukwa lifati the constitution. Wai kikila, kule likoni, watu wali lipo. Raika ka ingilia, hili mna tulete hapa sata. Wali kila nani, kila zora nisha chela ya. Yeni uchinga, wakwande. Wai tukam kukwa ni insect people. Amba amba tu insect people. No demolition, no eviction. Let us die with our people. Piro. Wakili, unasema kuna kuna a latest order against the AG after the 1996 order of eviction? Ah, sio eviction walipata ni perusio file. Ni obiti, ha? Walipo wamepata judgment ya 6.4 billion. Mm-hmm. Data wakambiwa waende formal proof hiyo tarehe saba mwizu jao. Uh-huh. Data jinti amerudi akaenda kwa chief magistrate court kutoka kwa high court. Uh-huh. Yo ndio hata sijaelewa. Nimeagiza hiyo faili ya miscellaneous ya lower court. Yes. Ndio nione Na huyu hiyo option. Huyu huyu mwindi ni mkora ni corrupt sana. Ni kama ameongaonga, ameongana huko. Ndio mimi naona. Eh kwa sababu sasa unaona sasa madisi wana haras wananchi huko wana threaten witnesses as if they are above the law. Na unajua watu wanaharibia wana rais siasa na mimi sitakubali. Sasa watu wanataka kupiga watu wamepeleka mabuldoza huko. Ah 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 yote nilikuwa nimetayarisha nini lakini Katenga akaniambia yuko. Sasa leo kesho tuende kotini tukue hiyo order. Hata niko milimani ah. sahihi mimi. Ah, if we can go to that eh, magistrate who issued the eviction order I set aside. Nita nita nitapeleka baadaye. Shida wata, shida wata, watapiga wanapiga watu saa 10 usiku. Saa 10 usiku? Eh ke asubuhi oh. kesho. Okay but wacha ni jaribu Ebu jaribu tuende kwa hiyo kwa hiyo kwa hiyo kwa hiyo kwa hiyo kwa hiyo majisa na mimi naenda state house hii. Ah. Eh tuanze pika watu 100 bwana. We cannot. Watu watu wanakupenda sana. We cannot my friend. We cannot pika watu 100. Hii watu wa DC wasitulete. Sisi ndio tulitafutia rais kura. Jana nimeenda nyama kima huko nimeambiwa usiongee mambo ya rais hapa. Imagine. I imagine in our own country people stopping me from talking good about the president. How? Hii watu wa Serbia rais yasa. Wakwende kabisa pale walizaliwa. Wasulete. Kuna Joyclet. Yes. Ongea juu hiyo maneno, nipenda yeah. useme hii. Eh. Uh-huh. So yes, okay. This is your waiting point. This is your waiting point. Yes. This is your waiting point. Yes, okay. Dinti gani mtu anaweza dai ako na order kwa high court na anaenda ku implement kutafuta order ya eviction kwa lower court? In fact the magistrate has no jurisdiction to give an order for yes. a property that is worth 6 billion. Yes. yes. The magistrate's jurisdiction is to issue an order be, for a property between 1 million to 3 million only. Those are the grounds in fact that I've seen. Wasi lata hii madisi bwana. Wasi haribia rais siasa. Wakwende, wakwende huko. Hiyo mambo hiyo sisi ni corrupt kuanzia kwa OP kuja paka chini. Watu wafanye vile watafanya. Kitu kubwa watafanya ni kuua watu. Wa kwende wa Serbia rais kuri siasa hawa watu washenzi. Raundi ya tutakubali wananchi wapigwe. Kila sawa na Libya rais siasa, rais anakana mbaya because of fake advisors, fake decisions kama hao. Ah huyo huyo kwanza ni ukora kwa nani? Kitu kubwa wataniua tu kuna kingine utanifanya. We have to speak for Kenyans and defend our president. Period. Wafanye kazi ya gold, wale vile walenda kuuza kukon shek na bado hata hiyo gola tutakubali 50,000 Kenyans living in UAE wakuwe intimidated by conmen who are here including people in government wasi tunata uchinga hii watu enough is enough enough is enough we must speak for Kenyans wasi tunata ushanzi kumbavu takataka kasia wao Kenyans are suffering watu wame toka kwa vitu wame ka raisi kwa kiti are suffering because of fake advisors Fuck this is. Fuck BSS. Fuck ministers. 
Wacha waniue kumbavu wao shenzi kumbavu wao kenya za train biashara zimefungwa nyama kima na kila mahali watu wanakufa because of stress si tumesaidia uhuru achaguliwe aoneshe good leadership si kutasa wa kenya and uhuru is a good person he is a good president but he is surrounded by fools idiots wa shenzi kumbavu patient That's a problem. It's okay. You you will you will just it. At what the dispatch 100,000 people. We can't. Unajua unajua wewe ulienda kwanza Saint Stephen's na ukawatulia na unaona huyo Peter Kenneth dada anakuja na limbuka na maneno yake. Bure tu. Huyo ni mwizi Peter Kenneth is a thief. Kama wachana tena hiyo is overtaken by events. They think I was sent by the DP kuambia you what this guys are thieves. Before Mohoro left nilipoenda ile interview ya ya ya, ya gubernatorial pale Strathmore nilipoa dozi ya huyo iko kwa DPP na iko kwa DCI they're not doing anything wacha wakuja waniue Kenya ikwe kwende washenzi Kenya za suffering what we need to sack wakili hapana iwezekani let us set a set that order first i'm in court just come